So I'm gonna explain a little bit what we have here from the nose. Uh, what are the difference between the other models? Well, the doors are fantastic. I really like the car doors that you can smash and that's it. Um, the landing gear also, we are not using the bow anymore. We're using the, the, the hard one. It's, uh, it's more stable and it will not produce any vibration uh, in case you want to use the, the, the big tires. The control system, uh, we keep the old control system for many reasons. Uh, mainly because it's lighter and it's more safer than any other push-push uh, -push control system. The, we're still using the monocoque system. This is very strong cabin. You are flying in a roll cage, in a carbon roll cage. The weight of this cabin, when they have the, the, the finishing, the paint, the glasses, is less than 32 kilograms. I will do the conversion later in a... There we go, you have to read right now what is the conversion in, in, in pounds, so it will be easier and I don't need to make any math. I'm really bad in that. So the technical part, let's, uh, let's talk a little bit about the technical part. Why I really like about uh, this cabin concept. How easy it is to work with. In many models, if you want to change the oil, if you want to do something, well, of course, a part of the tandem that they have the engine completely naked. Well, we have a massive windows here, so you can work on your engine, you can do the inspection, you can do the oil, the oil check. Very simple for your pre-flight. You have access to the mounting, to the control system, very important. You can have li literally clear access, you can touch it, you can move it, you can inspect that. All models come with the 915 by default, with all the sensors. Um, the performance on this machine is amazing. Uh, I have the opportunity to, flew, uh, to fly yesterday and it's, it's incredible. It's like having a really powerful electrical engine. It's, I, I really think about the, uh, to Rotax. They did a great job, a magnificent job. Rotax with this engine is beautiful. Um, the being able to have access to the lower part of the engine, the lower part of the controls in a closed cabin is a big advantage for security. It's a massive advantage for security. Um, all your pre-flights, you can check exactly how they are, if there are not any problems, they're not locking. The mixer for the fuel, the, 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 the fuel uh, filters, we have two versions. Uh, you, what you want to get in the, in the kits for the United States is the dual radiator. So in summer in Texas, in, in, in Florida, in the really hot areas of the United States, you will not have problem with overheating. Um, one of the things that I really like that actually help us getting better performance in the propeller in the older models because of the, of the wet body we have a, a little bit reduced uh, efficiency on the propeller because of the gearbox is, is a little bit longer than the old uh, 912. Well, making it longer, when the airflow comes to the propeller, we increase the efficiency on the, on, 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 on the blade, on each blade. So not just the extra punch of the engine, they, they, they give you the power they have. We also have a lot of efficiency here. All this efficiency will be transmitted to the best feature of this concept. The straight line from the thrust to the, to the, vertic to the horizontal stabilizer. Additionally, we took the, the, one, the concept for the other models for the, for the delta shape. The delta shape in these ones, they really, really give you a lot of stability. And the authority of the rotors, the dual rotors, because in other models, they have only one, rot one rotor and the, and the uh, horizontal stabilizers go in, in the bottom, go below. In this one, it goes directly through the truss line. You can see this go directly to the truss line and you have the dual uh, rotors that give you tons of authority on, on, on any maneuver you wanna go so you really can squeeze all the performance for your gyroplane. The pre-rotation system, we do not relay on any pneumatic, electrical, valves, fly, 
break. We don't know relay that. We use a clutch, and this is bunker. So we can, if, if you disengage the rotation at more than 170, almost 200 RPMs, you can clunk, engage again and engage again, because this is a clutch and a heavy duty shaft that you can engage and re-engage, and this is bunkers, this is forever. Uh, you only have to inspect every 100 hours the bearings here and the, um, uh, and the arm for the, for the clutch. It's, it's magnificent. The, all these models have the same system. Many others they have. It's beautiful. It's perfect. So you have a really, really good uh, pre-rotation system. If you want an open cockpit even, you can remove the doors from the summer. And it's like flying a small Huey. That's very cool.